Alright you guys, I uh, don't want you to take the title of this video too seriously because um, the actual topic of this video happened a long time ago. Now it concerns um, original KISS drummer Peter Chris giving his final USA and Australia live drum performances coming up in June and in May. Now, um, again, these, uh, special appearance and expo performances are said to be, uh, Peter's last performances in Australia and the USA ever. Now, um, the reason I say don't take this news too seriously or get too upset about it is, let's all be honest, if you know the history of, uh, Peter, then you know he actually hasn't performed, performed live since, uh, December 20th, 2003, his birthday, and his last show with, uh, Gene, Gene and Paul as is at that time. So, again, there's not too many details on what his final on what the title final performance actually means. Again, I just don't want anybody to take this too seriously because we haven't gotten an actual performance performance from Peter, at least in my opinion, um, since uh, his last show with Kiss in 2003. Now I guess you could take into account um, when him and his experiment is really played a private uh, party for their friend Eddie Trunk for the uh, 30th birthday of his radio career and when he came out to help Rob Zombie out on um, their song God of Thunder but let's be honest other, th other than those two White, white, weight song performances. Peter actually hasn't performed, performed in in the way that people people were used to seeing him since uh, December twentieth of oh three. So for me, it is kind of sad, mostly because probably because he's feeling this as the end. Well, we already knew this anyway, but it will probably be impossible. For us ever to see him get back, get back in the cat outfit or makeup or play drums with Kiss ever again. But they've already well documented their opinion on that situation. So again, don't take this video too much to heart. Again, it's sad if you're an overall Peter Chris fan, which I am, don't get me wrong, but I'm just being honest and saying there's no real need for Peter to build this as his last performance. I'm thinking it's for um, financial reasons more than anything because I, I feel like his last, last performance was really December 20th of 2003, which was the last date of the uh, Kiss Aerosmith World Domination Tour, which uh, took place in uh, 2003. So I hope you guys enjoyed and keep on rocking. Yeah.